Hello, hello, Carter here from Macklin Ford shooting a video walk around of our 2022 F-150 Limited Power Boost. This thing is immaculate. Uh, we actually just sold this to a gentleman uh, while his factory order was coming in. He kept it for a few months, uh, put about 16,000 clicks on it because he gets around town quite a bit and then uh, traded it back into us. So it's, uh, it's 2022 it's power boost it still has all of the features that these should have um the 2023s are coming without uh your heated steering wheel and without massage seats this one still has it so that's a plus that's a big big plus for sure uh the limited in and of itself is fantastic i'm sure as you know um but getting into it here you have your nice limited badging right up front there on the hood that kind of feeds in with you know the, the high quality paint you're gonna get your limited grill there you have your big 22 inch rims along the side and you have all the goodies you've got your big projector LED headlights there your high beams low beams you've got your front facing camera which is part of your 360 package um, that's gonna be where you can get a bird's eye view of the truck in real time makes it great for parking anywhere's tight or in a garage or something like that you have your front facing sensors there that's going to tell you if you're getting too close to something like i mentioned you have your 22 inch polished aluminum uh, uh, rims there which are fantastic we're talking about power boost technology uh, which again i love it uh, takes the regular 3.5 liter eco boost and it ramps it up a little bit that's basically been daisy chained to a big lithium ion battery underneath. It gives you a better fuel economy. It gives you an extra 100 foot pounds of torque. Now we're talking about 570 foot pounds of torque. Uh, so this thing will put you in your seat a little bit for sure. Um, it's just great technology and uh, it, it's become very, very popular. So much so that they actually dropped uh, the eco diesel from the lineup. So this is, uh, this is the bee's knees for right now for sure. Now, this is a good example of the paint that I was talking about there. In the sun, this tri-coat pearl paint looks absolutely killer. Uh, you can start to see the little flecks in it, and man, it is gorgeous. So it's a beautiful truck. You know, you got the nice pearl iridescent paint, you got your nice rims, and when we get into the interior there, you'll see that as well. You got your nice limited badging across the back there, uh, similar to a platinum, but again, this is one step above that. Uh, where you get um, the nicer rims and the really nicer interior so rear facing sensors you got your trailer hookup you got your uh, regular two and a half inch hitch seven four pin hookup you got your spare tire uh, key unlock there now this doesn't have a spray and bed liner in it as of right now you could always throw one in it's something i recommend if you're going to use the bed this is your little step out there and then you have your <coughs> let me just open up this tailgate here you have your generator here in the back so you've got your 240 uh, and you also have i believe four 110 outlets in the back so you can actually run like a little job site uh, off of this if you want and then you have your power tailgate in the back which is awesome so now when we get in you'll see how the steps pop out here for us so that's your little welcome home feature you have the limited badging here on the door sill, limited badging on the mats, and then obviously the star of the show is these seats. So you have quilted leather, uh, and it's kind of an intangible over video, but the leather that they use in limiteds and platinums, it's way more supple than they would have in like a lariat, say. Uh, it's beautiful, beautiful stuff. You have the limiting badging uh, on the seats there. Same thing on this side. You have your limited badging here in the middle. Beautiful. You have your big twin panel moonroof in the back there. And like I mentioned, uh, some of the features are getting deleted. This one still has it. This little button in the middle is where you're going to be able to access all of your massage features there for the seats. Um, so little things like that make it a really, really nice truck. This one is outfitted with Blue Cruise, uh, which is going to be your basically uh, autonomous driving, similar to what you might find on, say, like a Tesla or something like that, uh, in that basically once you set it up and all the maps have been updated for Canada, you're going to be able to, you know, do hands-free driving, which is 
phenomenal for Ford. I think Ford is doing some really, really cool stuff right now. Uh, as it stands right now, you have your adaptive cruise, which is going to give you some adaptive steering. You do, for the time being, still have to have your hands on the wheel. Um, I don't know when they're going to have all the maps updated, but it's going to be really soon here. They're, they're working uh, really hard to get it done for everybody. So that is a nice feature for this guy. Um, you do have all the regulars, which is basically going to be your heated and cooled seats, which I don't know if you ever had cooled seats in the summer. It is a godsend. It's lovely. Um, you have your heated steering wheel, all your dual climate control here. You have your new Sync 4 uh, 12.1 inch um screen here in the middle makes your you know your plasma screen tv at home look like a, a baby so really really nice features uh nice speaker system bang and olsen and it's the upgraded version of course keeping in theme with the limited it's the bang and olsen uh, unleashed so it's an 18 speaker system full surround sound and it sounds lovely so uh, I'm, I'm a big big fan of that uh, this is going to be your phone tab where you can set up uh, apple carplay android auto whatever you prefer you do have your built-in navigation with the new Sync 4 system. Um, since this is a hybrid, you can see in real time your power flow. You can see right there it says we're idling. It's telling us where we're using our power. You also do have your generator mode, um, which is going to be where you know you can actually use those outlets in the back. Like I said, if you want to do a small job site or a small campground or something like that, you can uh, run the truck and, and basically have a generator back there. This is your camera setup here. So right now it's facing forward. So that's what's right in front of us there. And then it's gonna be able to show you your 360 degree camera, um, which again, it, it's just so nice in real time to have that at your disposal so that uh, you make sure you're not banging up your, your awesome truck. So a, a little thing like that makes it, uh, the ownership experience just a little bit nicer is, is what I've found. Um, all your regulars, hazards, traction control, all that stuff. You do have your charging pad down here, your wireless key charging pad for your phone, USB, USB-C, your shifter here, which uh, in 2021, they brought out a new feature, which I'm a big fan of. They call it the interior work surface. So basically when you fold this down, that becomes your place to do some work or better yet, a place to have some A&W while you're on a road trip. Nice middle console, enough to fit your head in. The back keeps in theme with the limited look. You've got your quilted leather, power sliding rear window, and the biggest cabin space of any truck in this class. So it's very spacious, very roomy. You do have your power adjustable pedals. You have your driver's seat memory. They all work in tandem, and you can actually pair them up with your phone or your key so that uh, when you walk up to your truck, it automatically goes to your favorite position, um, the one that you've set out for yourself. So these trucks are fantastic. I'm a huge, huge fan, especially the power boost. Um, yeah, I love them. So I'll double check on the Carfax. I don't remember any skeletons in the closet. Um, Lonnie took good care of this truck while he had it for those few months. Um, but what I'll do is I'll double check on that, see if there's any recon that we did, and then we'll uh, go from there. So we'll fire this off and we'll chat soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.